Hey guys, today I'm going to show you, well actually somebody requested for me to do um, how you can make a picture uh, move in iMovie and I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So, let's get started. Okay, so this is what it's going to look like and I'm just going to lower the volume to this. So, basically it's just the image moving and I'm going to show you guys how to do it. So, you want to... um grab a video and I just have one for my life as Ava and then you want to go to you want to grab a PNG image it has to be a PNG image or else it won't work and if it has a white background then you can always just go um if you have a Mac you can just go in the photo editor and turn it into a PNG otherwise um just make sure that it has a checkered background so you want to drag your image to the video just like that just close this out so I'm going to drag it over here. Okay. You can just put it wherever you want. But which one did you want to click on the image? You want to go to this little crop thingy tool. You want to click fit. Go to this like square and click picture in picture. Go to dissolve and you want to make sure it's at zero. Okay. So then I'm going to go at the very start of the image. I'm going to go here. And basically you're going to be using what is called a keyframe. I'm just going to delete that. So you're going to be um, using what is called a keyframe, and this is where you're going to have all control of what you're doing. So um, I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Okay, so this is how I would do it. Um, if it was an image, I would just take it out of wherever it's at, and what you want to do is you want to make sure to click it. Okay, then you want to click the space bar and um, let it go for a little bit, so like this. Okay. Like that and then you want to move the image and it will automatically turn um, what colors is orange so that means that it will animate it so then let's we can put it here you want to click the spacebar again okay click the spacebar again and just move it spacebar move it spacebar move it spacebar and then just move it so there you go and it will look like this So yeah, it's really easy. It's just all about spacebar. So the, I would say that the, the only time you make sure you click on the keyframe actual thing is when you very first start it. So move the image and then click it. And then you won't have to um, click this anymore again. So basically only click it one time because when you automatically move it, it does it by itself. For example, if I move it, it's going to already click uh, make it orange. So yeah, um, if I hope this wasn't too confusing, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let's get this video to 50 thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.